Hey, what's up guys? So I wanted to bring back when Bart and I play games because I really, really enjoyed it. We actually started doing this when quarantine first happened for us in California. Um, and since then we've kind of been really busy, but now I'm like, I want to play. So it's I also really fun because through these games, it poses really different like scenarios and questions. So we get to know each other in a way that we wouldn't have if it's just a regular conversation. Yeah, so I was shopping on Urban Outfitters and if you know me, you know I love Urban Outfitters. And I went on their section, I forgot what this section is. Games? But no, it's not games. It's called Lifestyle or something, I think. Uh, and I found this game called The Effing Truth. Not sponsored, by the way, but I just thought it was really, really cool because in our relationship, uh, when we first got together, you I don't think I told the truth? No. Um, not that he lied, but there's just so many things about our sexual past that we just haven't really talked about. Like we have been doing a lot more of that during this quarantine, which is really, really cool. But a lot more sex. Oh yeah. <laughs> but when I saw this game, I'm like, oh, that's really cool. Cause it might ask some questions that I didn't even think about asking. So that's what we're going to play. And okay. the way it's going to work, it's kind of like bingo. Okay. Whoa. Did you guys hear that? That was our mosquito zapper. Yeah. Yes. Uh, and I already pre-filled these little squares and the objective is is basically to get five either up and down across or diagonally Ooh, so okay. that, if I get like 13 and 37. That's yeah, like, so ooh. now the point is there's each one of these cards has a number Yeah, so if that's on the thing. Yeah, if that's on your board, then you answer the question and then you can fill it up Okay, okay, let's okay. do it. Let's rock and roll. You want to go first? You go first. Okay number 29 you uh -huh. have 29? Yes, I do. Ooh, okay, so this goes for you. Okay. Okay, have you ever... You're going to pick one out of these two questions to answer, okay? And if I have, then I get to go... Choo -choo -choo -choo. Yes. Okay. Ready? Yep. So, I'm going to ask you two of them. You only have to answer one. Okay. Oh, have you ever... Option one. Made or received a booty call or had sex with someone more than 10 years your senior? Well, uh, I've had had a booty call. You have? Yeah. Okay, tell me about it. So, you actually know this girl from back in the day. Um, oh, that girl? Which girl? The girl that I know. The one that we went to the beach with when I had a boyfriend. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay, okay. So, this her, this is a girl named Nancy. You don't put people on blast. Who cares? You don't I don't know the last a, name. I don't want to get. A, I don't want to know the name. Okay. I don't care. This girl named. I already uh, hate this game. Natalie. And who cares about the name? Fine. So there's this girl. The period. <laughs> I like how, See, see how this game really brings people together? Well, anyways, uh, yeah, so there's this girl that I started dating. I thought she was cute, and we had a huge uh, similar interest in both fitness. So we got along really well, really quick. And then, um, I don't know, like, I just felt like we, it was a lot more physical, so we would have booty calls way more. But You, would, you would do booty call? Yeah, but back and forth. But I don't think we were Wait, very... what does your booty call sound like? What are you doing? Want to come over? Is that a booty call for you? Honestly, it was, I think, mainly her doing the booty call both ways. So either asking me to come over or her coming to over here. But they're so, like, what is it called? Like, you can see right through it because I should be like, hey, I'm pretty scared. I'm oh, sure what happened. She's like, I think there's, like, all these robbers um, outside of my house. Can I come to your house? And I'm like, in my mind, I'm like, if there's robbers outside, for you to come to my house, you have to step outside, you big dummy. And I'm like, yeah, just come over. It's going to be way safer over here. So. Nice. <laughs> okay. Uh, your turn. Right. For me. Ready? Oh, what number is it? I guess it corresponds to both of us. 26. Nope. Do you have it? I don't. Okay, let's skip it. Skip it. Okay. Yeah. All right. Do you have a two? Yes. Okay. So do you. Have you ever... Had sex during the last 24 hours <laughs> or oh. had sex more than five times in one 24 hour period. Five times in one. No, I no. Okay. I'll answer the first one. Have I had sex in the past 24 hours? Yes, I have. <laughs> it was actually with this guy. <laughs> uh, does that mean I also get to color in my two? Sure. Woohoo. Yeah. I already got four in a row. Do you really? Yeah. Okay. This game better not end that fast. <laughs> and it was, it was quite good. <laughs> okay, ready? Yeah. Number 47. Nope. Nope. Okay. We're all, for the most part, you would have more people, so there would be more story sharing. I have 48. Oh, God damn it. 46. God damn it. No. Like Matt Damon. Oh, I see. 45. Okay, I didn't really. 45. Okay, ready? Yep. 
Have you ever had sex while tied up or with a partner who was tied up or given or received a foot job sexual stimulation from someone's feet? I've definitely never got a foot job. Or given. Or given, given a foot job. You, you don't have to answer both. Have we ever tied each other up? I feel like we've tried it once. I, at least I don't remember. Then, oh, I guess not. So you don't get it. Uh, Here you go. Have you ever had a threesome? Oh, wait, I don't have 16. Do you have, oh, you do. Oh. For me? Okay, go. You have 16, though? No, I don't. You do. So does that mean... Sure. Remove it because it can't help it. We might be fucking up the rules, but I think I just like that we're sharing. All right, number 10, you have a 10? No. You do, right? There. Yeah, I do, I do. Okay. Have you ever had sex with more than 10 different people in your lifetime? Or had sex with more than 50 different people in your lifetime? Dang, my number is so low, I've never reached even 10. So that's it. Me neither. So I don't know. So we I guess both I'm have, sharing some reached, getting it. We both haven't reached. I have four in a row. No, but you didn't get either or. Oh, okay. So you don't have four in a row. I don't have four in a row. Do you have damn white it. out? <laughs> oh damn, we're playing like that. Hell yeah. Cause you know what happens on this channel? She always loses. Oh, you're gonna turn to read there. Okay, do you have eighteen? Nope. Thirty-five? 35. Yes, I do right there. Ding, ding, ding. Damn, I don't get any of these cards. Okay. Have you ever had sex with someone who you considered a celebrity or, <laughs> anyway, or pretended you or your partner was someone else during sex? Oh, shit. Don't lie, you motherfucker. Uh, never had sex with a celebrity. Uh, it's one or the other. You don't have to answer both. I know. Okay. But I'm, just, I'm talking out loud. Am I not a celebrity? No. And then, um, pretend it's someone else during sex? No. Damn it. Swear? It. Yeah, why? Oh. Why, you have? No. Oh. I'm just surprised. Why are you so surprised? I don't know, because I think I'm a role-playing type of guy? I don't know. Like, I just... oh, fuck me. I'm fucking, uh, Wait, Ronald Reagan. Ooh. With that? No, I don't know. I just feel like, because guys are more visual, like... I'm Hillary Clinton, fuck me. Like oh. that? Oh. Yeah, you never did that? No, you have? No, I never have. Oh. But I just thought because guys are more visual that they would need if what they see is just either boring or they've seen it too much We've been together for 12 years. So if you ever did that with me, I'd be like I get it. No, never. Okay. Number nine. I Have it, but you don't. So like, oh my turn, right? Oh, so yeah, I need I need to read. Sorry Okay I'm just gone. Have you ever had a one-night stand or had sex without using any STI prevention or contraceptive the unsafe way um STI so okay so I've never had a one-night stand ever and have I ever had so I mean with boyfriends I would have sex but we sometimes wouldn't wear a condom so does that yeah. count as that yeah if you're irresponsible and you get to color number nine well I mean we both like would take tests yeah so if you're very unsafe dangerous and irresponsible and a sinner, oh, okay. go ahead and okay. uh, Thank you. why don't you just color that in, you sitting. Okay. Number 36. 36. Th no, I don't have 36. 36. 23. E nope. Dang, we don't have any of the same numbers. 30. Yep. Okay. Have you ever had sex with a virgin Ooh. or had sex with someone who didn't speak your language? I definitely had sex with a virgin. You did? <laughs> that was my first time. Oh, you guys are both? I was a virgin too. You guys are both virgins? Yeah, I was a virgin. Oh, that's cute. She was a virgin. And it was so funny because we first got together, I think, in junior year. You want to know her name? I don't know why you <laughs> want to kidding. put it on. I'm, I'm just, just, I'm just know, trying know, to do it for witness kidding. protection programming, I know. okay? I'm just, there's so many names out there. Okay, fine. Let's so, do the name. No, I'm going to say. So when we were both juniors in high school. Um, juniors we, in high school? So naughty. Really, maybe sophomores? I forgot. Sophomores That's even years. worse. 15, 16? Yeah. I was 15 for sure. So we, uh, we when we first got together, we're like, I oh, didn't have I'm going to wait for marriage. Oh, yeah, I'm going to wait for marriage. Oh, that's so true. Oh, we see eye to eye. And then after like three weeks, we just had sex. Three weeks? Yeah, we couldn't take it anymore. That's so cute. You got raging hormones, you know? Yeah, I don't know. I was I too felt scared. so guilty, though. Really? The first Why? time. But we just did it again after just to make sure we're going to get it again again. Okay, bye. The same day? No. Oh. 
You know how hard it is to have sex in high school? You got your parents no, involved. I don't know. You don't have your own place. It's oh. difficult. You gotta bust a lot of like, like quick maneuvers. For sure. Like a secret agent. You know? I mean, I had sex in college, but I was still living with my parents. So yeah, I mean, I guess it's the same thing because I didn't have my own anything. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's because you're a loser in college. Should Number one. Oh, well, my turn to read for you. Do you have one? Oh yeah, one? yeah. Okay. Sorry, I'm just so used to it. Have you ever masturbated more than five times in one day, or masturbated in a way that could be dangerous or harmful to your health? Um. Okay. I think I. I think I masturbated. Um. With something that might have been harmful to my health. For real? Like what? I think one time, I don't remember. Oh my God, this is so embarrassing. But I think I used like a cucumber with a condom on it one time when I lived at home. Were you trying to be safe still? I mean, I just was like, it's a, it's a cucumber. So I don't want anything to like stay in my body. Oh, you penetrated yourself. Yeah. And that was like, that's when I discovered. Where did you have a condom from? I mean, high school. So they, they, they didn't pass it out. Yeah. Did you yeah. like that? No, that's when I discovered that I didn't like any type of penetration. And did you put the cucumber back and your mom made food out of it? <laughs> no, I threw it out. You threw it out? Why yeah, are you, yeah, why yeah. so wasteful? Oh my God, I feel like any answer I give you is <laughs> exactly. just for me. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah, and I think at that point, I can't, I just remembered that. Um, I think at that point, I, I was just so horny. I think while you were having sex, I was like not having sex and I was yeah. really fucking horny. Um, yeah, and I think I used a cucumber, either the cucumber or a banana or something, but some some type of phallic type of yeah. uh, perishable. I, I remember that. I get it. Just not my finest moment. I do get it though. Hey, at least you're safe with the cucumber. Yeah. Oh, your turn. I, I think it's, I can't believe I just shared that. Why? That's so weird. I totally forgot You're about it. disgusting, I know. Stop. It's the 41. effing truth. This is what you find out in this Stop. game. Stop. 41. Do you see me differently? 41. Yep, that's too late. You pro? No. Hi. Okay. Have you ever watched other people have sex or had sex in front of an audience? I know someone who's had sex. I'm not going to tell you. Who's had sex in front of an audience. Okay, really? Bye. I don't know. Have I ever watched other people have sex? No. Like you're talking about in the same room, right? Or just where you can see them. No, nah, I don't think I've ever like seen Like maybe them. looked inside someone's window. No, I don't, I've never seen anyone else have sex. What was the second question? Um, Had sex in front of an audience. Wow. I know. That's like some sex museum or like Amsterdam sex, sex show, show type stuff. No, yeah. I never. No. Okay. Yeah. Good. Good. Okay, do you Good. have a number 40? Number 40, yep. Have you ever spanked or whipped your partner with an object during sex? Or? Or paid for sex? Paid, for, I've never paid for sex. Have I ever spanked a partner with an object? No. Spanked or Other than my hand? No. You don't get this point. God, why am I so vanilla? Okay, 25. Ding, ding, ding. Okay. Um, have you ever given or received roadhead? That's oral sex while driving. Or had um, penetrative anal or vaginal sex while driving. Oh my God, Por both partners in the driver's seat. So I've had a uh, roadhead before and her name was Gia. Hey! Was, uh, oh, I was supposed to give away names, huh? I forgot about that. Fine. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. I'm a pleaser, all right? 25, right? Yeah. Oh my God, no one has five yet, okay. All right, number seven, you got number seven? No. Okay. Yeah, number 32. Uh, yes. All right. That was my volleyball uh, number. Jersey? Oh, yeah. Cool. Have you ever had sex in prison? No, I'm just kidding. Oh. Have you ever had sex with a married person? Or given or received explicit permission for your romantic partner to have sex with someone else? Mm -mm. Okay. Given or received explicit permission? Oh, like a hall pass? Yes. Mm, no. Okay. Number six. No, no six. No six. 43. No 43. 37. 37. Ding, ding, oh, ding. Oh, God, I have it too. Uh-oh. Okay. What have does that you, mean? Uh, remember when we both have it? If you could have it, then we could both answer it. 
Oh really? Oh, is yeah. that how that works? No, but we did, you decided to say if you you had it too. So oh, I'm like, yeah, go ahead. okay. Okay, thirty-seven. Have you ever had sex with someone who you thought was stupid, uh, or given or received a golden shower peeing on a partner during sex? So I did have sex with someone that I thought was stupid. It was one of the chicks that I mentioned earlier, and so um, I we had this one conversation, and I think that's what made me like kind of break off our fling. And I remember, uh, so I was like, she was studying for one of her tests. I'm like, oh, so how'd you do on your econ test? She goes, oh, I did, I think I did pretty good. No, she goes, I did do pretty good. I'm like, oh, cool, what'd you get? She's like, I got a C. And then I'm like, um, okay, so in my mind, I'm like, usually people, when they say they did pretty good, I mean, it's like an A or a B. And if you think C is good, then you not doing good must mean like an F. And I'm like, I don't know if I could be with someone that has You're standards so... that low. So Asian, we yeah. were like 2.0 GPA. I don't think I can do that. Honestly, at that point, I'm like, I messed up so bad in high school. Oh, uh, that makes sense. I am trying yeah. to do good in college. I need to yeah. surround myself with people that are also doing good in college, not okay. a bunch of other fuck ups like me. Yeah, okay, I'll give that to you. Um, so, so I get it? Yeah. Ding, ding, ding. So then, I guess let me answer too then. Um, have I ever had with someone that you thought was stupid? I think. All my ex-boyfriends at this point were stupid. No. Um, I did have one boyfriend that I thought was pretty stupid. Why'd you go out with him? Because he was so sweet. He had so, he like was so cool with his family and he was super duper sweet. But the more like I thought he was just really kind hearted, so like was willing to overlook trying to focus more on his other strengths. Yeah, I was I trying see. to overlook like the book smarts of it, but it just got to the point where I was like, I can't do this. It was just a tool. Um, kind of. I see. Yeah. But I've never had a golden shower. Other than you peeing on me, peeing on me in the shower. Doesn't even count. <gasps> oh my god, I thought I won, but no, I didn't because no it way. didn't count. You don't win on this channel, buddy. Fine. You might, you might actually win. Well, I don't know. Okay, go. I better get 44. You go. You, I just read for you. you did? Yeah. Oh. Wait. Do you have a 27? Wait. Did you? You know, I read for you, and then oh, I ended okay. up 27. Yes. Yeah. Have you ever injured your partner during sex or cheated on a romantic partner? Uh, have I ever, no to cheated, but have I ever injured? No. I have. Do I get to go ding, ding, ding? You son of a bitch. You have what? Remember that one time, like, you wanted me to get a little bit more, um, like, feisty? Oh. It was at the Bellagio. So we were having sex, and then, uh, we were doing it doggy style. Oh, my God. And then, uh, I think I went too overboard, and I felt so bad. But then when I whacked you in the... Wait, well, can you get, give more detail? You, you gave the wrong detail. Okay, so we're doing doggy style. We're, we went from one side of the room, and we kept going. Oh, it's the other side of the room. She got rug burned all up on her knees. I'm just kidding. No, we were uh, we were doing doggy style, and then we, we wanted me to, like, get more... Like, you know, be more expressive and explore. And then so I was, like, spanking you, and then you're, like, harder. And then one time I went, whack! And then... Uh, I think it was hurt so much that you just started crying immediately, and then my wiener went pew because I felt so bad. Yeah. And I was like, oh shit, I think I hurt my bear. I'll never forget that. Yeah, you did hurt me. That was pretty rough. I know. I'm sorry. Never asked for spanking again. But I'm, now I'm glad I did it because I got a point. <laughs> you fucker. Okay, seventeen. Nope. Okay. Son of a bitch. Eleven. Nope. Okay. Oh, effing story. So talk about something that turns you on, but is embarrassing to admit. But what? Does that okay. get a point? Now, well, this I'm much. trying to win. All right. Number 19. Yep, I got 19. Okay. Have you ever shaved or waxed your pubic hair or shaved or waxed someone else's pubic hair? I shaved my pubic hair. Not sponsored, but sponsored on other video. Shout out to Manscaped. Thank you so much. Whatever. Did you win? Oh, I got to color that in. Nope. Oh my god, you only need okay, anyway. So do I. Do you have a 22? Uh, yeah. Right there. Damn, I get them all around. Like, there's like lines going this way, but uh, whatever. Have you ever had sex that was so emotionally intense you cried? Or had sex with someone you were living with but not dating? Whoa. Uh, I've only lived with my family and other females. So I never had sex with any of my female roommates. And I, if I ever had sex that was so moving that I cried. Emotionally intense. Oh, there is no cry? Did I just add that part? That I cried? No, you cried. Oh. There's, because it's out of emotions. I cried. I don't 
don't know. Did he cry? Like, oh my god. It's so <laughs> have I cried with you? I, I don't feel think like so. I have. Yeah, we're having sex. But I don't remember. Okay, we'll just say no. God damn it. Hey, come on, come on, come on. Have I, have I, have I, have I? I don't remember. I We've think been I together have. for so long. I've had I know. sex so many times. I know. I'm sure you have. You want to just color it in? Okay. <laughs> sure I'm still have. so far away. Look at this. Look at this. You just have to get that one number. I know, but you have two chances. Do I? Yeah. Okay, number five. Okay. I don't have a number five. Number four. I have a number four. Okay. Have you ever penetrated someone anally with a penis? I don't know why they worded it like this. Oh, penis, dildo, or sex toy, or given a rim job, lick your partner's anus. Um, I have never done anal, but I have licked your anus, and I think, <laughs> I think you liked it. <laughs> ding, 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 and I'm glad <gasps> you did. Oh, damn it. I'm glad I licked your anus. Did you like your licked your anus? Sometimes. I come sometimes. I don't know. Sometimes you're not in the mood, huh? Yeah. Sometimes I'm just like, nah, dog. Do you have a 28? No. Nope. This is way too much information. Do you have a number eight? God, I hope nobody that really no, knows eight. person watches this. No. Do you have a 15? No. Damn, have... no wonder I'm... Why do I always lose on this Do you have a 50? Now? No. Do you have a 24? No. What? Do you have a 20? What in the fuck is going on? Do you have a no. 31? Oh, you have you... the weirdest paper. You do not on anything. Do you have a 14? Oh yeah, you do have a 14. Okay, go. Oh okay. my god. Have you ever had sex with a person on the same day you met them? No, that's or a Or had sex with someone you met on a dating app or website? Um, uh, no to the first one because that's again the one night stand. And then when I was, I guess, sexually active with other people, dating on a web or like meeting someone on a website and then fucking was looked down upon it was almost like you're a loser huh? yeah you're like only losers did that so yeah. no. damn it okay can i just say yes to something what I the have fuck? Any... Get a turn square. go whack three please 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 please, please. Nope. damn it i have three give me 48 i'll give you 44. i don't have a 44. Give me 41. Give me 41. give me 41. 34. I have a 34? No, nope. Really? Give me a 48 or oh, 41. Jesus. 13. Um, yep, I do have a 13. Okay. Have you ever had sex with more than one person in one 24 hour period or had sex with a person whose name you weren't sure of? Still one time? So, have you had sex with more than one person in 24 hours? No, I don't think so. Or had sex with a person that you weren't like sure of their name? Oh, no. So close. That was the number I needed to to win. <sighs> damn. So damn, we damn know a lot close. about each other. So damn close. None of these have really surprised F me. Effing story. You. What does that mean? Oh, it's okay. Okay. That's not a number, so it'll just take forever. Yeah, but 33? Yes. Good have you ever that. had sex with someone from a foreign country? Or sexiled someone? What? Meaning, ask them to leave the room so you could have sex or been sexiled. Sexiled someone. I have been sexiled. You have 33? I do. Oh my god. Do I get to do. Wait, wait, wait. I feel like I have been kicked out because people were gonna have sex. That's happened to me. That's in high school. In high school? Yeah. You were hanging out at some friend's house and that we're gonna do it, get out of here? Yeah, I think Whoa. so. Yeah, I have. I think so. Yes. Yes, motherfucker. I have to. Mine was uh, actually so close. mine was actually Joe. Really? Yeah. So uh, he was staying. He was sleeping over with his girlfriend at the time, and then during the UCLA days, we should skits together all the time. And then uh, I left something back at my apartment, so I ran back to go get it. And then when I ran back to get it, um, it was like locked. And I'm like, wait, what the hell? Uh, like the chain from the back. Oh. So I couldn't just open the door, and I went, and I'm like, what the hell? And then Joe's like, wait, wait, wait. And I'm like, why? What happened? He goes, we're fucking. I'm like, God damn it. That's funny. <sighs> Do you have... Good old days. 42. 42, yeah. Me too. Okay. Um, have you ever been someone's accomplice in cheating or experienced squirting vaginal ejaculation 
your own or a partner's. Never help people cheat. Um, Experience feet, like, I guess, vaginal ejaculation. Have you ever squirted on me then? Mm -mm. No. Damn it. Why don't you squirt on me? I don't, I want, I don't want to, but I want to. <laughs> Just okay. like so win this damn game. No, yeah, 39, yeah, yeah, yeah. You have 39? But why are these numbers like all around? All like right. there's no cluster. Have you ever had a sex dream or fantasy about someone who was in this room? Or been paid for sex? I've never been paid for sex, unfortunately. Um... And then, have I ever had a sex dream about you? I've had a sex dream that you were having sex with someone else. I think that counts. The fantasy? That doesn't sound like a fantasy. Oh, a fantasy? Well, I guess it's a sex dream or fantasy. I've had a sex dream, but you were having the sex with someone else. That sounds fun. Okay, fine. I get it. 30 okay. what? 30 39. What? Ooh, getting close. Dude, I feel like I'm going to color everything except for like the five that I need to. Okay, ready? 38. No, 38. 48. Yes. Okay. Have you ever? It's my winning sex? number if I get it. Have you? Oh, shit. This one's funny. Okay, ready? Yeah. This one's the second question's weird. Okay. Have you ever had sex with someone who was a parent? Or had sex with the parent or child? Wait. Had sex with the parent or child of a close friend? Oh shit! I think I think it, if older people play this, yeah, yeah, or people yeah. that were young parents, that one would make. I've sense. never had sex with a parent. I don't think. No, for sure I've never had. And then parent or child? Nah, didn't. Okay, I thought you were gonna include me as a parent, but guess not. Can I? No. Because that's 21. what I don't know if they're asking for. I know. Obviously. Fine. Twenty-one. You have twenty-one. Yes. Have you ever had sex that was so emotionally intense you fell in love? So, so I guess so I guess I'm assuming it's like you weren't in love oh, and then you had a so I love this I've person. never done that. Or had sex in a foreign country. Yes. Yes, I have. With you. I know. I think Taika was made in a foreign country. You were the first person I ever left the country with. Oh you did? Oh, I get that one too then. You do. I have a twenty one. Ding 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 ding, that means I won. You did? Yeah. What I say on his channel, you know who the champion is? Okay, I think I've learned my lesson. I don't think I'm gonna play on this channel anymore. So if you guys hated these videos, but it's fun when I beat you all over the place. So if you guys hated these videos, perfect, because guess what? Your prayers have been answered. I'm never gonna play on this channel ever again. But if you love these, let us know in the comments below and I'll continue to lose just for you. Um, but yeah, uh, if you guys are interested in playing this game, it's really, really cool to find out shit about your partners or just with friends. This seems like a really fun game if you wanna get to know each other or just like a little yeah. drinking game and open up about each other. I think it's pretty cool. Yeah, because I think a lot of people have a weird time or hard time talking about sex just because I feel like they're going to be judged. Yeah. Um, but this and already... these aren't really questions that you could just bring up randomly without being weird, you know? Yeah. Like, have you ever had sex with a person with a child? It's weird to say over dinner, but if you're playing a game, it's like, oh shit, it's you fair. have? That's crazy. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please let us know in the comments. Um, and make sure to follow us on Instagram at BartCon or Geo underscore Antoinette. And let us know if you want to see us play more games and let us know what game to play. All right, y'all. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye. Bye.